Well, we're out at a family outing today at uh, one of our grandsons having a swimming lesson. And they do their swimming lessons in a lake like this. Um, <laughs> isn't that great? So they all come out, they all come out to the water. It's not, it's not a particularly warm day today, but it's, I mean, it's not cold. It's t-shirts and shorts weather. But um, I look at the, I'll just give you a bit of a view of this lake. It says uh, no dogs allowed up the up the pontoon. What what they do just beyond these um, little boys here with the rope, they go they go in on the ladders there, and they swim from that end over to here. But the lake is uh, much bigger, obviously. Even gives you a depth there, 1.8 meters. But look at that. There's, you can see little trails up into the woods there. This is um, this is the local nature reserve where we are. There's lots. Of, seems like the whole place, um, pretty much just yeah so it seems like most where well, everywhere you go there's another nature reserve um, which is nice so it means it can't be sort of spoilt by building or and you have to be careful also um, right here I mean there's little ducks that uh, sort of live <coughs> they live quite happily with um, people being around, they don't worry, so it's it's quite nice. But up, up, um, there's some steps over there that goes up and just around to the left. <coughs> excuse me, just around to, to the left of where we are now. There's um, like an outdoor gym as well. So it's all sort of provided. Well, the gym is free, so, and it's all made out of wood and logs, so there's sort of arm strengthening, push up things, <coughs> climbing things, and you know, um, so there's a lot of that sort of stuff, and it's all, it's all just out in nature, so it's really, really beautiful. And these, this isn't particular to this area, this is. We find this sort of stuff all over Sweden, which I find really, really nice. Um, yeah, so that's why, you know, it's so pleasant to be here. And of course, everywhere you go, <laughs> literally everywhere you go, there's a Swedish flag flying. And, the, and here is no exception. Uh, this is uh, is a different flag, but it's much longer than a sort of standard sort of flag, and it's sort of tapered at the end. People have uh, people have those around their houses. Um, let's just take you up. Oh yeah, another thing is barbecues are everywhere. You can have a barbecue there and they provide seats and stuff. So they love the outdoor, the outdoor life of um, just being in nature. So we're doing the, uh, the grandparent duties today, bringing the children out to their swimming lessons. I was asked if I was going to go in, but it just looks too cold. No thanks. <laughs> so, so um, yeah, so this is the big free car park. That's where we're parked. It's another motorhome just there.
This is the this is the outdoor gym. And with every with every bit of kit they have the instructions as well, sort of how to do them. There you can see pop your feet under there and do set up. Oh there's somebody actually doing um, a bench press with the logs there. There's all sorts of these things. Um, oh yeah, here's a bit more instruction. So make sure you stretch before you start training. That's always a good idea. And then there's these uh, those two logs. That's how you do those. And <coughs> And there's, there's all these, it's all made out of natural materials. So it's really, really great. And it really fits in well with, uh, with the um, surroundings. All sorts of stuff. Now, oh yeah chin-ups but they're sort of outstretched and and more sort of chin-up bars monkey bars of course <clears throat> oh how I wish I could do one of those and then, <laughs> then there's the dips so the leg raises and pull down bars and all sorts of stuff so really really great there's a lot you can do here and this is all just in the nature reserve and bear in mind that there's actually no charge for this at all there's you just come here it's all free there's a lot of this stuff it is free and of course the walking tracks. I'll just show you, just show you the the walk. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna walk out. This will go around the lake, actually. So, um, but there's the start of the walking track. You see, it sort of wanders into the distance. A lovely, lovely, lovely um, walk around the lake, which is. Uh, really nice to do oh here's the other the other side of the um, walking track and you can see where it goes up 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 there's a really steep hill and quite a big car park actually plenty of room and i think i think i'm right in saying yeah you'd be all right to um to stop here overnight I don't think there's any restriction on that um, as long as you didn't start to sort of take the mickey and stay here for you know a very long time um, you're okay and of course don't spoil the landscape as it were don't uh, don't leave any sign that you've been here all the children are in the water now so that's a bit of an update a bit of a what we're doing today um, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning very cloudy day warm maybe maybe 18 degrees something like that um, they're quite close you know, there's a bit of a cool breeze which is you know be quite nice um, but yeah it's a um, it, you know it's a really wonderful place to be so if you've not traveled to Sweden yet 
in your motorhome or caravan give it a go it's it's a bit of a trek from the UK um, as I say it's we're just south of Stockholm and that's uh, 2,000 kilometers or 1200 miles um, but it's a, the journey's nice so taking in the journey going across the Channel Tunnel into France getting into the airs making your way through Belgium, Germany, getting the ferry across from Rostock to Trelleborg. Um, it's all just a wonderful, it's a wonderful journey. Lots of excellent memories that we're building up and we're hoping you're enjoying the journey too. So I'll see you next time. Bye for now.